Hello, everyone. Have you ever wondered about the journey of the food you eat every day? You've probably enjoyed cauliflower, a familiar vegetable in many family meals. But did you know that every year, over 2 million tons of cauliflower are harvested from vast fields, following a modern and meticulous production process? Join me as we explore the fascinating journey of cauliflower, from the sprawling fields of California to the dining tables of millions of people around the world. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, don't forget to hit the subscribe button now so you won't miss exciting videos about agricultural technology and fascinating life stories. Every year, vast cauliflower fields spanning over 20,000 hectares across western U.S. states like California witness the growth of millions of cauliflower plants. This region is not only renowned for its breathtaking landscapes, but also plays a crucial role in producing over 2 million tons of cauliflower, contributing approximately $1.1 billion to the economy. However, the story of cauliflower is more than just cultivation. It is a long and intricate journey, from the moment seeds are sown into the soil to the time the cauliflower heads are harvested and exported worldwide. And you might be surprised to learn that at every stage of its growth, farmers implement advanced technologies to optimize both yield and quality. The process begins with seed sowing, a crucial step to ensure the plant's survival. Seeds are planted at a depth of approximately 0.5 inches, then covered with soil and kept moist. After a few weeks, when the seedlings reach a height of 4 to 6 inches, they are transplanted into the fields, spaced about 16 to 24 inches apart, to provide ample room for growth. However, for cauliflower to thrive, farmers must not only provide meticulous care, but also use various fertilizers to ensure the plants receive sufficient nutrients. Automated irrigation systems and sunlight play a key role in helping cauliflower achieve the highest quality. Equally important is monitoring the factors that affect plant health. Large farms utilize high-tech equipment, such as cauliflower planting machines, capable of planting up to 5,000 plants per hour, significantly saving time and labor. GPS sensors help optimize cultivation processes and minimize plant loss. As the cauliflower heads begin to form, farmers must closely monitor their growth to protect them from pests and diseases, especially diamondback moths and soft rot, formidable threats that can ruin an entire harvest. When the cauliflower heads reach their ideal size of 6 to 10 inches, farmers begin the harvesting process. This takes place early in the morning or late in the afternoon when the cauliflower is at its freshest. Sharp knives or shears are used to cut the heads from the stalk, ensuring the product remains undamaged. After harvesting, the cauliflower is placed into containers and transported to storage facilities. This is where modern technology comes into play, with conveyor systems and automated harvesting machines helping to reduce processing time and increase efficiency. With vast cauliflower fields, processing the cauliflower immediately after harvest is crucial. For fresh cauliflower, the process involves trimming off excess leaves and stems, keeping only the firm, high-quality heads that meet the standards.
For frozen cauliflower, a closed processing system is used. This includes cutting the cauliflower into smaller pieces, thoroughly washing them, blanching them in boiling water to retain their color and nutrients, followed by rapid cooling and quality inspection before packaging. If you think cauliflower is impressive, you'll be surprised to learn that in the journey of cultivated and processed vegetables, there is another star that is just as remarkable, kale. This leafy green has gained immense popularity not only in everyday meals, but also as a staple in the healthy diets of millions of people around the world. Kale is known for its exceptional nutritional properties. It is one of the easiest vegetables to grow and is widely cultivated in many parts of the world particularly in regions like North America and Europe. Kale has become a staple in various modern diets, including paleo, keto, and vegan, making it a key ingredient in healthy eating trends. Kale can be grown year-round, depending on the climate conditions. Interestingly, it is highly resilient to cold weather and even develops a sweeter taste after being exposed to frost. Kale seeds are sown at a depth of 0.5 inches, with a spacing of 18 to 24 inches between plants. Once the seedlings reach a height of about three to four inches, they are transplanted into the soil, ensuring they have ample space to grow and thrive. Like all vegetables, kale requires essential nutrients to grow optimally, particularly nitrogen and potassium. Proper watering and maintaining stable soil moisture are crucial in kale cultivation. Unlike some other vegetables, kale thrives with ample sunlight which is essential for its healthy development. Automated irrigation systems and sensor technology are used to monitor soil moisture and adjust water levels accordingly. This not only conserves water resources and reduces labor costs, but also ensures high production efficiency. When kale reaches its ideal size, typically around six to eight weeks after planting, its dark green, crispy leaves are ready for harvest. The harvesting process mainly takes place early in the morning or late in the afternoon when temperatures are cooler, helping to preserve the leaves' nutrients and freshness. After harvesting, the kale's base is trimmed, leaving only the fresh, green leaves which are then immediately processed. For fresh kale, after trimming, the leaves are packaged and distributed to supermarkets and grocery stores. Broccoli, also known as green cauliflower, is one of the most beloved vegetables not only for its delicious taste, but also for its incredible nutritional benefits for health. Broccoli seeds are sown in early spring when the soil temperature is warm and the climate conditions are ideal for plant growth. Broccoli thrives in soil with a pH between 6.0 and 7.0, so farmers must ensure that the soil is properly cleaned and well prepared before planting. The seeds are planted about 0.5 inches deep, then covered with a thin layer of soil and kept moist throughout the growing process. Once the seedlings reach a height of four to six inches, they are transplanted into the fields. This process requires great care and precision to ensure that the young broccoli plants remain undamaged during transplantation and continue to grow healthily.
One of the key factors in broccoli cultivation is regular watering and ensuring that the plants receive sufficient sunlight. On large broccoli farms, farmers often use automated irrigation systems to conserve water while maintaining stable soil moisture. Additionally, farms incorporate sensor technology and GPS to optimize planting and crop management, reducing plant loss and increasing overall yield. Broccoli is typically harvested between 60 to 90 days after planting, depending on climate conditions and soil quality. Once the broccoli heads reach their ideal size, farmers begin the harvesting process. Similar to cauliflower and kale, broccoli is best harvested early in the morning or late in the afternoon to preserve its freshness and quality. The harvest is carried out using sharp knives to cut just below the base of the broccoli head, ensuring minimal damage to the plant and surrounding parts. After harvesting, the broccoli is placed into containers and transported to processing facilities. After harvesting, the broccoli is transported to processing facilities to maintain its freshness. For fresh broccoli, excess leaves and stems are removed, keeping only the firm and healthy florets. The product is then packaged and prepared for market distribution. For frozen broccoli, the processing steps are similar to those of cauliflower. The broccoli is thoroughly washed, cut into smaller pieces, and blanched in boiling water to preserve its color and nutrients. After blanching, it undergoes rapid cooling to maintain its crisp texture and freshness. Finally, the broccoli is packaged and stored at low temperatures, ready for distribution to the market. From the vast fields of California, cauliflower, kale, and broccoli have undergone a remarkable journey. A fusion of advanced agricultural technology and the hard work of dedicated farmers. This journey not only brings fresh, nutritious vegetables to our tables, but also serves as a testament to the power of technology and sustainable agricultural development. If you enjoyed this story and want to learn more about advancements in agricultural technology, don't forget to hit the subscribe and like buttons to support us. Share this video with your friends so they too can discover the fascinating journey of these everyday foods. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.